Hi, my name is Sage Johnson. I'm a soccer student athlete here at IMG Academy. And my mother, Shelly Ripple Rogers, is a seven-time NCAA world champion. It was definitely competitive growing up with his mom as an Olympian and athlete. We would always fight over everything, always be competitive. Even if we were just playing a game in our backyard, we would like work for it so much. But it was really fun because she would like try to like get me to like work harder in everything I did. I've always felt like a certain pull towards soccer. Well, I've been playing since I was seven years old. I've always loved it. I grew up playing with my siblings, my older brother and my younger sister, and we played in our backyard in our club, and I've always just had a love for it. My favorite soccer players are definitely Carly Lloyd and Julie Ertz. I've always loved watching them play. My mom is my best friend. She is definitely my inspiration. She always did tell me when she was swimming, her confidence was like her main thing because she knew that she outworked everybody, and I always do try to emulate that. Like when I'm out step on the field, I always know that I work outworked everybody here, and so that's where I get my confidence from. Hey, Mom. Hey, hey. hey. How's it going? It's good. How's training going? It's good. We have it today. I grew up watching my mom as a female athlete, and I always looked up to her, and I always want to be that strong, independent woman who is an athlete as well. I watch her through her sister's eyes. She has two baby sisters that watch everything she does. And being a strong female in today's world is huge. I want to teach my girls to, to grow up and be confident in who they are, you know, to work hard every day and know that they can achieve anything through hard, hard work. And I think that's a really cool environment that she's in and she inspires me watching her train every single day to be the best to be. And so I'm very, very proud of her. What does it take to be how, like at your level that you were at? You're on your way. You're definitely on your way. Every single day, when you go out there to train, I know I've told you this many times, in order to have confidence to race or to compete at the highest level of sports, you have to train that way. And that confidence comes from knowing that you are outworking everybody else around you. And if you know confidently that you can step up on that field and you've done all the work necessary, harder than everybody else around you, you naturally will have the confidence to compete. And I know you're like that. To me, being a strong female athlete, exactly what you're doing, just encouraging little kids to be like you. Awesome. Um, I agree. I think being a strong female athlete, you have to be able to use that platform to affect change in young females and know that what, what people expect young females to do or think or, or say or what you see on you know, social media is not, is not the answer. You have to be able to be strong and stand up and work hard and, and know that you can accomplish anything that you set your mind to. And I think you are a female role model, whether or not you know it. And there are young kids here and there that are looking up to what you do and how you act and how you react in certain situations. So it's a responsibility, but it's a really cool one. My mom is definitely my best friend. She's my biggest inspiration. She always says school is really important and it always comes first, but also that your sport does matter a lot. And if you want to get better, you have to train by yourself when people aren't around. I want my legacy to be working with little kids who don't have soccer, who don't have an experience in soccer, just like my mom, who works with little kids, learning how to swim, teaching them how to like get connected with the sport.